The layoffs reflect a 15% reduction in staff. In addition, 70 positions which were to be filled next year will remain vacant. Schedule changes are also a part of Portsmouth General's plan to save money. 200 employees will work 37 and a half hour weeks rather than the usual 40 hour week. According to the hospital administrator, cost cutting measures were made necessary by lower hospital occupancy, escalating operating costs. But more severely, I suppose, we've seen the uh, drastic cutbacks in, in Medicaid, SLH programs, and some of these other indigent uh, programs. Peary said some changes in services will also be made. We're scaling down our operation. We're going to staff 217 beds rather than the 264. So we're not diminishing or decreasing or eliminating any services, nor are we uh, decreasing any quality of services. The layoffs and schedule changes began this past Monday and should be completed by the end of 1982. The estimated savings to the hospital, $1.6 million in fiscal 1983. In Portsmouth, Irene Mayer, The Daily News.